Hey everyone, I just want to talk to you about what's going on today. We're all of a sudden thrust into some very uncertain times. It can be very scary. All of a sudden, we went from you know, no worries uh, and everything was going great to a virtual lockdown and isolation from all of our friends and uh, neighbors and uh, classmates and teachers and everybody around us and it is it's scary it, uh, it's the same thing as being afraid of the dark which is not the dark itself but fear of the unknown and that's where we are right now we're afraid because we don't know we don't know what's going to happen next and that's why we're isolating ourselves we're doing the social distancing and I just want to tell you that even though you know, we're in uncertain times we don't know what's going to happen next I want you to know that you can take faith and there are a few things that you can do to better prepare yourself for the road ahead and to make this time a whole bunch, uh, a whole lot more easy. I remember when I was on deployment to Afghanistan and just was out in an unknown, scary desert that I've never been and the enemy could have been anywhere. And I had to be there with my team and you know my unit and. I remember one day we were uh, we were eating uh, out of uh, MREs, just food out of a bag, and, and not the greatest food in the world, uh, and miserable and thinking about uh, how great it would be to be back home and having home cooked meal, or you know, go out to a nice restaurant. And while thinking that, the wind would kick up and turn already terrible food into a dirt covered sugar cookie and <laughs> we make the best of what we've got we survived we pushed through and we made it home and it was the difficult times that I went through both uh, on deployment in the military and after my injury and it's the hard times that make the great times so much better take faith right now that through these hard times, the good times are going to be so much better and you're going to be so much more appreciative of what you have and so much more grateful for those who have shared this time with you, your family, your friends. I promise you in 5, 10, 15 years, nobody's going to remember how hard it was or how scary it was or how painful yeah, this time was. They're just going to think about it as a strange time a weird time and a time where we you know learned something new about ourselves and our community take this time right now to take stock of you know your relationship with your family and with your friends and your neighbors do your best to get out and maybe you know mow a neighbor's lawn or you can still social distance uh, and get outside. I'm in my workout clothes because right after this video, I'm going to head to my uh, garage and get a workout in. That's one very important step uh, that we're doing here is we're not changing our schedule just because we don't have to leave to go to work. I get up at the same time every single day and I get a workout in and we have family time and I have work time. and meals in between and we keep a routine we're also all trying to uh, put our effort into growing our bonds with each other uh, here in the family being creative and uh, learning something new or discovering something else and having a at-home adventure whatever it is take this time use it to your advantage and have faith that this won't last for very long, it won't last forever. And the good times are coming and they're gonna come back soon. 
Thanks.